We're here at Chodot Field where Temple players are taking part in the 2013 Pro Day. Is there anybody in particular that caught your eye today? Well, I'll tell you what, uh, uh, Montel and Mac Brown just get a quickness and a speed that, that, that's always going to be uh, eye catching. But, but uh, you know, some, some of these other guys, you know, uh, your Bodies, uh, you know, the guy that's interesting. What went into your preparation for today? Um, a lot of hard work. Two weeks of working hard in Georgia uh, with dual performances. Uh, just trying to get everything down for the combine. 40 starts. Uh, just working hard. Um, you know, I was in Atlanta training, you know, training uh, with uh, Montel uh, and Marty. So we were just, you know, every day lifting, running. It was intense. Pretty much position work. We did position drills, practice 40 starts, L drill, shuttle. We did a lot of weightlifting for the, uh, the bench test. Brandon, just talk about your overall performance today. Uh, it was good. You know, I definitely had a chance to come out here and do all the drills. Uh, a lot of the scouts were, were laughing about me doing all the drills because they never saw a kicker do, do all the drills. But I was excited to get a chance to show my uh, talents out here in front of, uh, I think there were 17 teams here. So it was a good opportunity. I mean, I think it was okay. You know, I, I always set myself to a high standard so I know I could do better than what people expect me to do. When I, when I get out there and, and get to show them my football skills and, you know, be a lot happier. We're in a good 40. I just think I had an overall pretty good day. I think I did a pretty decent job considering the weather. Um, you're never satisfied with what you do, but you know, I'm happy with the numbers I put up, and hopefully that'll get me where I want to go. All right, so physically today they saw what you were capable, but say verbally what you want scouts to know about you as a player. I'm the hardest player in the country. Like nobody plays harder than me. Nobody. Uh, that's all I want to know. I, I mean, whatever you want me to do, I do it. And you want to do a brick wall, I want to do a brick wall. I don't care. You want to play? I love the game. It's my passion. My heart is what I've been doing since I was a child. I would just like to know that I'm a great football player um, who's going work my hardest, make plays, and uh, I'm a great player with great character on and off the field. Up until April 25th, what will you be doing until then? Uh, just continue to work, uh, stay in shape, working out for any teams uh, that are interested, and just waiting for the draft. I still have a workout next week with the Patriots. Um, the Dolphins is coming up, and I have, uh, I'm going to Dallas for that uh, Super Regional combo on April 7th. So all 32 teams will be there, so it's definitely another great opportunity to showcase my talents. The first round of the draft takes place on April 25th. Until then, the Owls will have to wait to see where their fate lies. Reporting for Owl Sports Update, I'm Danielle Meslini.